Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install Apache Cassandra on Ubuntu. Apache is a high performance open source NoSQL database engine that provides fault tolerance, linear scalability and consistency across multiple nodes. Apache Cassandra is ideal in IoT applications where massive data is collected. It also comes in handy in social media analytics, messaging services and retail applications. See, I have connected to Ubuntu. Let's verify whether it's Ubuntu or not. More slash etc os hyphen release. See, I am on Ubuntu 22.04. You can search how to install Ubuntu 22.04 on VirtualBox in my channel. First, we have to update the packages sudo apt get update you must have sudo privileges or root privileges i just updated few minutes back i have updated so it takes less time in your case it may take time if you haven't updated the packages once updation completes the prerequisites to install apache cassandra is jdk apache Cassandra supports on Java long term support versions. Those are 8 and 11 at the time of making this video. I am going to, you can run, you can install. See, whatever the commands I am executing in this video are available in the video description. See, I am going to install OpenJDK 11. If you want to install 8, just replace this 11 with 8. Latest stable Java version is 11. So I am installing OpenJDK 11 JDK. Press enter. See, it is saying OpenJDK 11 is already the newest version. So I have, which means I have already installed. Let's verify whether Java is installed or not. Version. See, it has installed 11.017. Next, we have to install the apt transport package. Clear screen. Yeah, I have already installed this package. Now, we have to add the Apache Cassandra repository. Next. I am importing gpg keys. Next, we have to run again sudo apt get update. Now, we have to install, now we have to install Apache Cassandra. This may take time.
See, we have successfully installed Apache Cassandra. See, its version is 4.07. Now verify Cassandra status, whether it started or not. sudo systemctl status Cassandra. See, it is active and running. It has started 5 seconds, 5 minutes ago. 5 minutes ago. Press Q to quit. Now enable Cassandra to start whenever the Linux system has been rebooted. sudo systemctl enable Cassandra. If we want to stop, just give sudo systemctl stop Cassandra. Again, if you want to check the status, see it is inactive and dead. If you want to start again, just replace, just give start. It has been started. Let's verify. See, it is started again. Now we are going to see how to connect to Cassandra. Just give CQLSH. See. We have successfully connected to Cassandra. Its version is 4.0.7. Let's verify again the version. By running the command, show version. See, we have installed Cassandra 4.07. Okay. If you want to exit from this console, exit and give the semicolon. If you want to configure Cassandra, just go to go to cd slash atc. Then ls, see here the file ls hyphen ltrh. Then go to Cassandra where see here the directory name ls. If you want to configure, then you have to edit this ML file. More ML. Sorry, more Cassandra dot ML. See, these are the settings. If you want to change the cluster name, just you have to replace cluster with required name. Like this, we can edit the cluster information. So, in this video, we have seen how to install prerequisites to install apache cassandra then we have seen how to install apache cassandra on ubuntu linux for more cassandra videos please subscribe my channel thank you